Hey guys, it's Red from Red's Third Dimension Gaming, and today I am unboxing this. I finally got it, but I actually found a guide online, so I don't know what I'll do with this. Um, I guess I'll just keep it as a collector's item and not really use it because the online guide that I found is really good. So, there's this. And there's the back. And, of course, the side. Oh, and before we start this, I actually got, I gotta show you something. I got these Star Wars things from Star Wars the Fourth Sale. It's these bins, and they're $15 for all of them. I think it was $15, it might have been $10. And it's all these bins, which is pretty cool. Just to show you them a little bit. So I think they're pretty cool. This is, a. Uh, it's all from Star Wars uh, Episode 7. So here's the guide without anything on it. There's that. And it also gives you a free e-guide. Which is kind of useless right now. If they would have gave it to me on time, I would have appreciated it more. And right in the inside is a big old map. And it tells you each and every chapter. This game's trophies for online are actually fixed. You don't need to play the online 50 million times in order. So I'll see if I can try to show you the uh, setup here at the game guide. It even has a description of every character at the beginning here. Um, yes, this is a hardcover. So let me see how this is. This is just going over the mechanics of the game. It's not too bad. I didn't like the God of War 3 one much at all. That one was kind of... Not like this. Looks like it's set up pretty nicely. And let me see if they show you any of the treasures. Which they do. They do show you and they tell you about the treasures right there. So that's nice. And... Yeah, you don't have to like look it up separately. It's right there. And they even tell you the trophies for each level, which that actually might be more helpful than a guide online because they just tell you all the collectibles. So, yeah, that's pretty nice. I might have to actually use this now, which is nice because it'll tell me what to do. Let me see what the back pages look like. They even have a trophies page. They have... Okay, they got a collectibles guide where they tell you exactly where everything is. They have everything in the back here, extras. Yeah, this is all the collectibles. And then they got tips on crushing mode. This tips. It can't be too much of a guide. Uh, nope. They just give you a couple tips and that's it. Well, that's really that's really shitty. They should have just put it in there like another guide just for it. They just go in a little tiny, like this much, this little bit, on, uh, like less than a half a page. They do have the trophies on here, which you can find it that easily on your own. That's not hard. Okay, so yep. And then they have some multiplayer items where they tell you all their accuracy, everything about all the little guys. So that that's a simple guide. It's not a hard guide like to create, I guess. It's not a hard game. The multiplayer was amazing last night when I played it, so check out my live stream I'll be doing today. Some more single player and then multiplayer. Hopefully finish it today. Hopefully I'll finish it today, and then you guys can be excited for that. I don't know. I can't make any promises that the walkthrough is going to be on this channel. It might be on the other channel. 
So go subscribe to my second channel. Actually, it's my third channel. But my first original channel, I don't use anymore. Um, I just have some cool montages on there. And glitches. Um, my second channel, it was going to be like an Xbox channel. But now it's going to be pretty much anything that I want it like action-wise. Like Western games, probably. That's probably what's going to go on there. Like Uncharted, multiplayer, that's going on there. Uncharted single player probably is going to go on there until these copyright strikes go away. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to thumbs up, comment below, and subscribe. See ya.